what's new on the item shop. Kind of curious to see what we got actually. Uh, okay, this bundle, the Edge Factor bundle, is still here. This skin is amazing, by the way. Really like this backlink though. Uh, oh, Diecast is back. Monkass is back. <gasps> they brought them back. People are gonna be so happy they brought back the ski skins. Oh my goodness, they're all like here. Oh, wow, wait a sec. Okay, Mogul Master, that's probably like the most popular one, am I right? Okay, if you are picking up anything on the Fortnite item shop, be sure to use code ASMR Gaming. Wow, let's check it out. Um, okay, Mogul Master carve through the competition this is the most popular one so that's why i started with this one uh i don't know a lot of like pro players twitch streamers use this one and then a lot of other people started using this one mogul master does not come back that often so it's just super cool to see carve through the competition part of the winter ski set very cool skin, also a tryhard skin, I think I mentioned that, but yeah, it really is. Um, comes with the mogul ski bag, ski combat readiness backpack, part of the winter ski set. I always like how the back blings and everything for each outfit is a little bit different, like this is the Canadian one, so as you can tell, from the helmet to the shirt, like the outfit, to even the skis themselves, they are customized, and the backpack, of course. Very nice. Okay, so right here, we got the default one, the Mogul Master, without a country, basically, carve through the competition. Looks cool. Comes with the Mogul Ski Bag, Ski Combat Readiness Backpack. So this is a default one, so if you're not a fan of any of the countries listed, this is a good one to get. You don't have to be, you know, Canadian to use a Canadian skin or something, of course. But uh, some people, you know, they just want to have the regular one, so that's this. Then we have the USA one, carved through the competition. See if you notice the skis are different, backpack with the stars on it, same goes for the clothing. Very nice, each one is a 1,500 V-Bucks. Here we got the Canadian one, we already watched or looked at this one. Here is the Great Britain one. Carved through the competition, shout out to the UK. Looks cool actually, this one's kinda nice. Uh, ski bag, back bling, that looks cool. The back bling actually might be one of the better ones. I think Canada has the better looking skis though. Like, each one has its own, like, cool thing. At least I think so. The gloves are nice, though. Look at the gloves on the Great Britain one. Over here we got France. Carved through the competition. French one's actually kind of nice. I like the colors and stuff. Back bling. Oh, the skis are pretty good. I like the stripes on the skis like that. The red, blue, white. It looks nice. Ski combat, readiness, backpack, backpack's okay. Skis are probably my favorite part of this one. Then we got Germany. Germany's is pretty nice too. Carved through the competition. Skis are also kind of nice. I like the backpack probably the most. That looks nice, backpack's nice. I like how that looks. Ski combat, readiness, backpack, mogul, master. And China. This is China, yeah, this is China. Carved through the competition. China gets their own, that's interesting. And local ski bag in China. I wonder how popular Fortnite is in China. That's pretty cool that like, people all over the world play Fortnite. Like I know in Korea was like, they were pushing it back a few seasons ago. If anyone's from China, let me know how popular Fortnite is over there. Pretty awesome. Ski combat rating this backpack. I like the helmet, if I'm gonna be honest, with like the star on it here, that looks pretty cool. And Korea, Korea gets their own. Pretty nice, actually. 
Helmet for this one is good too. Both China and Korea, I like their helmets. Carved through the competition. Looks good. Oh, I like those skis. How the color like kind of goes from like blue to a purple to red. That looks nice. Back bling's also really good. Mogul Master, if I was gonna get one, I'd maybe get the Korean one. I don't know why, it just looks nice. Here is the ski boot harvesting tool. Give them the boot. 800 V-Bucks, rare harvesting tool, no unique animation, nice sound. I love the design though, look at the design of this thing. It's so weird and fun, I love it. I love, love, love it. Came out on season two, but I bet you have never seen this on the item shop because it barely ever comes back. Like, seriously, you can probably count on one hand the amount of times, how many times the ski boot has come back. Like four times, five times, something like that. Like, it's super rare. Uh, then we're back to that one. Down here are the male versions. So we got Alpine Ace. So aerodynamic. So this is the default one. Kind of like a scarf there. It looks kind of cool, that color. Back bling, Alpine accessories, ski combat, readiness, backpack. Looks good. Then we got Alpine Ace USA version, like the stars. Back bling, also at the start, back bling. I think the back bling for both the male and female ones are kind of the same. The male one is like slightly bigger. We can quick check though. Yeah, I think the male back blings are just a little bit bigger backpacks, possibly. It looks like it. Let me know in the comments if that's true. Canadian one. So, aerodynamic, alpine accessories, here's Great Britain, France, just going to be going through them because basically they're similar to the female ones, China, and over here we got Korea, male Korean one actually looks pretty good. But, I'm going to mention it, uh, the female ones are definitely way more popular than the male ones. Since it's a tryhard skin, you'll see a lot of people using like these ones right here. Uh, cool skins though. Diecast is back, I mentioned it before, but wow, that's interesting. The die has been cast, 1,200 V-Bucks. He does not come back that often. We got Chromium, like just the other day, so nice to see him here as well. Came out in Season 4, I remember. I thought the metal, like, skin, like, body looked kind of nice. Monk S has returned. Send in the monkey. Fun skin. I have this one. It's crazy and cool. I like how the tail's kind of animated, too. That's nice. Uh, very detailed. You can actually, like, see, like, the fibers, like, uh, for the stitching for this, like, outfit of the monkey. It, it's nice. Anyone ever have, like, a stuffed monkey, like, animal plushie or something like this when they were a kid? Kind of cool. Peel pack, back bling. Uh, nice back bling. You can actually combo this with like peely and a bunch of other banana like accessories and things like items. It looks cool. A snack for the road. Peel pack. Coaxial copter is back. Interesting part of the tech ops set. This also does not come back that often. Dual rotor. Tactical Copter. This looks really weird in game. I've seen people like glide around this back in like season 7. It looks nice, but it's like crazy because you're going to be looking through the double like rotating uh, rotors up here as you're trying to land and you can see through it, but it's like kind of distracting like when you're trying to land sometimes something looks like a person and then it's not, uh, but it's cool. Yeah, definitely a bizarre glider that not a lot of people use, so nice to see that back today. It's like the first time in a long time this has returned. Howl emote is back, and if you want to let off your werewolf howls, this is a good emote. Stand in front of a moon for maximum effect. Here we got the wiggle emote. Dun, 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 dun. Catchy music, great emote, 500 V-Bucks, definitely worth it. Never stop wiggling. This this emote is amazing. Like seriously, get it. 
challenge setup is pretty good too. Mind over body. I like how you, it's, it's so awesome to like do this when you get an elimination, fall backwards, and just like spin on them with one foot like this, like one leg out. It's kind of cool. And then we got the Edge Factor bundle still here. Be sure to check it out. I love the skins and the back blings. Harvesting tool is awesome too. It changes color with the animation. Glider is awesome. And Kratos is still here as well. And the bundles are still here as well. So yeah, that is everything on the Fortnite item shop. Thank you all for listening, for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all next time.